What's up you guys? If you saw the caption, you know what this is. This is my haul video for Fashion Nova. Um, if you see my other videos, then you know that I got a BBL this year, which has made it kind of hard for me to do any haul videos because not all of the clothes fit. And I feel like most of the video would be lost because I'd be upset. Almost every time I do any kind of big purchase, whether that be Fashion Nova, Pretty Little Thing, um, Nasty Gal, anything that I do, always something doesn't work. There's always one item, two items, three items. Sometimes the entire haul doesn't work. So I'm not able to give you guys a video. I feel good, however, about this haul. And I went as far as to not even open the package. So I have not even seen the things in person. You are going to be seeing my reaction to them, me trying them on for the first time right on camera. So let's get into it. If you don't already, like, subscribe, um, follow me on all my social media channels. I link them in the description as well as my bio on my YouTube channel. You can also check the description for all of the things that I purchased. I'm going to link everything, including this. I know it's just a little athleisure outfit, but I always get lots of compliments on the shorts. They come in different colors. This is just a cami from Target. I'm gonna link the necklace because I also get a lot of questions on my necklace um, offline, in person, and then also on Instagram. So again, welcome to my channel, welcome to this haul, and let's see what these clothes look like, okay? And I was not lying, I'm gonna open it on camera. I don't know if other people do this on YouTube, like actually open the clothes or if they open them offline, but I, Figured why not film a reaction? Maybe there's some things, ooh, little coupon. Maybe there's some things that I got that I forgot about. I'm just gonna throw them in my work chair. There's a lot in here. This is probably gonna be a long video. I have a, oh my God, it's like all falling. This is gonna be a long video, for sure. So I definitely have some dresses. I have some shoes. I have a pair of shoes. I can open these on camera first since they're gonna be kind of hard to show with the outfit. So I actually already have these in white and I got them in brown for the fall season. I'm gonna get kind of close so you can see the texture. It's like a little suede action, little faux suede going on. So I'll wear these with some of the outfits. Like I said, I have them in white. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, you'll see me wearing the white ones in a couple of photos uh, so that you can kind of get an idea of what they look like on and how they photograph. But they are, they're not comfy the first couple days that you wear them like any shoes, but after a while they feel comfortable. And I really like that they have, I'm a chunky heel girl, I can't do the stilettos, um, but I like that they have the platform on the shoe because it gives it like an added little height. So, all right, let's get these clothes. Okay, you guys, this, I decided to try this on first because I was the most nervous. Like I had an idea in my head of what it was gonna look like. And I've never, even before my surgery, I never owned any kind of like leather pants, but I always wanted some. And of course these are pleather because they're Fashion Nova, but they're kind of like leggings and I'm obsessed like I can't okay let's look at the butt y'all <laughs> like the fact that it's so hard for me to find pants that fit my new shape my new body and these they're a little tight but they're comfy tight they've got like a lining on the inside you don't feel the leather on the inside which is so nice and they fit so well. And I want to talk about this top. I'm going to close to the camera so you can see it. So again, this is outside of my comfort zone. I am not a print girl at all, but I love fall and I love fall colors. And this top just kind of spoke to me. I was like, let me go outside my comfort zone. So the fabric is so soft. There is so much stretch. I don't know if you can tell on camera, but I mean, it is so soft, so comfy. The stretch is giving me skims. I have a lot of skims clothes and this kind of reminds me of that. Not the way that the fabric feels, but just, I mean, I love this. Okay, so I went ahead and put on some other Fashion Nova shoes that I have. If they still have them, I will link them so that you can kind of see the full fit. I'm gonna 
elevate my voice so you can hear me that far. But I wanted you guys to be able to see the full fit, the full twirl. Hopefully this looks good because I can't see that far, but y'all. All right, let me do a little walk. I, I love this outfit. Um, again, I'm gonna link everything, but these are a large, extra large. And this is a medium top. I will also link, I'm gonna do my measurements when I get off of this. Um, and I will put those in the description so those of you who are looking to purchase these outfits can get the right size. You got, I can't get over it. I'm sorry. This is just, I would have never. All right, let's move on to the next one. All right, so this is a bodysuit. This is a size medium. I think I got it another color. I'll find out when I go through this. Um, but yes, this is a medium bodysuit. It's just t-shirt vibes, you know, not anything special. I do like the mock neck on it because it gives it that little bit more fall vibe. These pants are a size nine. They're not my favorite Fashion Nova pants. They don't have as much give. That's probably good for fall because you don't want very thin material when it's cold outside going into winter. They do have a cute, I don't know if you can see that little butt detail, detailing. So I do like that. It just doesn't give, it's not as stretchy as I'm used to with Fashion Nova pants. Let me see if I can get closer. They're not as stretchy as I'm used to, so for my curves, I do kind of feel like packed in. They're not so tight I can't breathe. I did do a sit test, so I know I can sit in them. But yes, these are how they look. Let me back up so you can see the full fit. Shoes, also same ones as the last outfit by Fashion Nova. So size medium and size nine. I'm keeping it, but it's just not anything special. Like this is a great casual outfit. So moving on. I did that I was going to go ahead and show you what the brown looked like. It's the same as the, ooh, my pocket. It is the same as the red, kind of red bodysuit that I just wore. This one is brown. I have the same pants on, but I figured I bought it. I'll show the color that I was gonna have a haul. So this is it. Okay, so this is another bodysuit. It is high cut. I love it because I feel like it just gives that little bit of sexy when you're all covered up in the fall and in the winter. So it's long sleeve, high cut. This is what it looks like behind. Still wearing those same jeans that I was wearing in the other outfits just to give you an idea of what jeans look like with this. But yeah, um, it also has a little bit of detailing underneath, kind of like a corset detailing right underneath the boobs. So this is what it looks like from far away. Again, same fashion of the jeans. It's got the little high detailing going on. And yeah, it's comfy. It's ribbed. If you can see the, the ribness there. Sorry. Don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> um, but yeah, so love the color, love the fabric. I like the high cut. This is definitely, you know, adding a little sexy to your fall. So, okay. So this turtleneck, I was really excited for, but I should have known it was going to be a little thin. As you can see, you can see my bra right through it. Um, this is a Skims mesh bra, by the way. I'll link it even now that you can see it. You can <laughs> also know what I'm wearing as a bra. I do think you'd have to wear a cami under this. This is something that you would need to layer. Probably like a gray. I don't know if I would do a white cami because the white's just gonna come right through. It's really up to you. Maybe a, even a t-shirt. You will have to layer this, which is fine. That's fall, that's winter, that's what we're going into. It's going to be cold. But I am a little disappointed that I can't just wear it on its own. Again, same jeans. This is what it looks like. This is a medium. It comes in other colors though, so it's probably going to be just as thin with other colors, but with darker colors. In the daytime, you're not gonna be able to see. I wanted kind of like a white ivory just because, you know, trying to brighten my, my 
outfits up. So, all right, move on on. Okay, so <laughs> against my better judgment, I bought this because I really, really wanted a corset top. Now, I'm keeping these jeans on for you guys. I would not wear these jeans with this. They're not high-waisted enough. Um, I am a little bloated this week, so don't judge the stomach. Usually it is a lot flatter than this, but I'm just gonna keep these jeans on because that's what the haul is. I'm working with y'all. Work with me, I'll work with you. Um, but yeah, against my better judgment, I bought this just because I've always wanted some type of corset top. I would style these with different jeans, different pants, I'm not sure. It's very thin, you can't wear a bra um, with it. Obviously, I'm not wearing one anymore. And it is, I mean, you lift up and your girls can come out. It is very high in the back. So it's, I mean, it's very cute. I like the color. It is just a little thin. I mean, again, they could fall out at any time. You can see this, this is a size medium as well. I could probably have gone to a small, but then my arms might have been, it might have been too small there. But not even wanting you guys to see my stomach. Um, but yeah, so this is it. It's cute. If I could go back in time, I probably wouldn't have gotten it, but I'm gonna keep it because I'm sure I can find something cute. Even if it's just for pictures, I'm sure I can make this work with some lighter color jeans and boots. So, okay, I'll move on. <laughs> I actually kept my bra off for this video because this is how I would wear it. When I saw this, I was thinking Skims dupe, like for their tank tops. I really like the material. It's double lined. It's actually in the name, but it's double lined. And it's perfect to not wear a bra with. I love it. It's like thicker. So it's a great layering tank top. And this will be the last outfit with these jeans. I'm finally moving into dresses. So again, this is a double lined tank. I thought, you know, skin stoop. It really is double lined. It's very thick. Let's see if I can get that on camera. You can kind of see how thick it is. And it's a size medium. So let's move on to the dresses. All right, this is the first dress of the haul. I love this chocolatey color. I tried to back up so you guys can see the length. And I went ahead and also put the shoes on. The shoes right here, how cute. Yes, this is very fall. I'm loving the color. Um, I just realized you could see that little plastic. You didn't see it. Um, so this is the dress. I really, really like the color. It's actually, this is, Thicker, maybe by half or double of the white turtleneck I was wearing, but it's kind of that similar ribbed material. But I do like that it's thicker. Not wearing a bra again, because that's how I would wear this dress. And here it is from the back. Yes, very simple. I love it. I love the button detail. It hugs the curves in the right places. Again, here's the full length. So right above the knee. And this is what it looks like with your heels on. Love it. I believe this dress comes in other colors too, but I was going for a chestnut vibe, matching my nails a little bit. So, all right, let's move on. Okay, next dress, it's long sleeve. It still has that same rib material, but it's a little bit thicker on the ribs and it's actually just a thicker material altogether. See if you can see how thick, like this is how I would want a actual sweater to feel. And it just so happens that it is the sweater dress. I love the mock turtle up here. Um, it's just very fall. Again, not wearing a bra, that's how I would wear it. So this is how it looks. I'm gonna back up a little bit so that you can see the length right above the knee, just like the last dress. And I kept the brown shoes on, but I probably wouldn't wear this with the brown shoes. I'd probably do black shoes with green, but very cute, very comfortable. It feels like a sweater. So as a sweater dress, this is probably over the last one, this one actually feels 
like a sweater dress like cut it off and it's a sweater i wish i wish i wish the white one felt this way but it's fine i love the length of the sleeves if you have really long arms you're good like they go pretty far down so on a on a girl with long i said long sleeves long arms if you have long arms you're good because it'll probably come about right here and you'll still be fine so yeah all right let's move on to the next one Okay, last but not least, this little black number, it's got the ruching detail down the middle. I should mention this is a medium. All of the other dresses that I'm wearing in this video are a medium. I'll make sure to put it in the description, but just so that we know while we're watching that this is a medium. This is giving very much witchy vibes. I actually bought this just to have like a going out dress or a dinner dress, little black dress action. I probably wouldn't wear this in the daytime just because I think the ruching might be just a little too sexy for the daytime. But now it's giving me very like, like witchy vibes, like where's my witch hat. So let me back up so that you can see the length. I kept the same brown shoes on, so I'm not going to put that in just because they do not go with this dress. <laughs> okay. But they come right above the knee, just like the other dresses. But as you can see, it kind of gathers here that's because the ruche gathering goes all the way up there is no ruche on the back i actually prefer that i have other ruche dresses in my closet and i don't particularly like the ruching on the butt i think i have like one dress that i do like but i've actually never worn it um and that's probably why i think that the ruching it's great for some girls but for me it draws so much attention to my butt that I don't want the attention, so. <laughs> but I do like this ruching in the front. I feel like it gathers in my waist. I really like it. Again, not wearing a bra because that's how I would style it. Um, but yeah, so let me get a little closer so you can see the ruching here. And yeah, I think this is definitely a winner for me. Out of the three dresses so far, the brown, depending on how I put this in order, the brown dress and the green turtleneck. I think this one is my favorite as far as comfort level, so. All right, let's move on. Before y'all come for me in the comments, I'm highly aware that this is not a fall winter dress, but hear me out. I've never owned any type of tube top anything and I saw this dress plus one other item um and I just I really liked the way it looked like on the girls in the um pictures and I just wanted I wanted to know what it felt like to own a tube top dress and honestly I kind of love it I think I could put a jacket over this and it still be fall I'm gonna back up so that you can see how long it is yes honey we're going under the knee with this okay so I think with the color and adding like a jacket or a sweater of some sort, I definitely could still wear this in the fall just because of how long it is. It's actually pretty thick. It is not a thin material. I also love that it has like the little ruching right here. So it kind of gathers the girls. And yeah, I, I love this. I don't come for me haters. Like I'm, you know, I like it. I like this. I think it looks good on the body. I think it hugs all the curves that it needs to and i think with a jacket it would be really cute so all right moving on to the last piece of the haul okay here we are again this is not a fall outfit it's a fall color but it's not a fall outfit now i'm an athleisure girl my day-to-day -day errands are mostly in some type of athleisure shorts kind of how you saw me on the video in the beginning um so i'm not getting dressed up to run errands but i might still want to look cute now this is not fashion nova but this is how i would style this i have to show you guys how i would style this so that you do not go crazy in the comments about how this is not a fall outfit okay this this is what I would do. See this oversized jacket? I'm gonna tag it in the comments. This is actually from Target, from Target. This, this is how I'm gonna, this right here, and I'm gonna do it with like some sneakers or some boots or something. We're still gonna be cute, okay? Hoes don't get cold, remember that, okay? Cardi B's famous words, hoes don't get cold. 
And, you know, if I want to look like a hoe, then I'm going to look like a... But yeah, no, I love it. The material is a, it's a little on the thin side. I'm not going to lie. Um, I am a little scared about the girls coming down because there's not a lot of support. But I think with a jacket, exactly like I was just saying, oversized, still see the booty, still cute. I still have the heels on, but I would not wear this with heels. I would probably style this with some sneakers or some boots. So, all right. Well, that ends my haul for Fashion Nova. I hope you enjoyed it. It's my first haul, so don't, don't give me too much crap in the comments. Don't tell me how bad it is. Um, I'm still working on this, but yeah. So thank you for following me and my journey, my BBL, my new body body that I'm working with. Um, still going to be giving you guys more content, but just stay tuned. I have a whole other life outside of social media and YouTube. So I am doing the best that I can, but I hope you guys enjoyed again like subscribe leave comments ask me questions check the description i will be putting every single thing that you have seen on me in the description box and please follow me on TikTok, twitter instagram sorry i'm thinking of all the things that i have in my link tree just go follow me on all of those but thank you again so much for watching and i'll talk to you guys later